Only how you bunch of this you number one bad Asian coming to you again from now. AC delivered. My AC got fixed, guys. Oh yeah, trying to ruin everything career mode, but the AC got fixed. I am no longer the polar bear in 98 degree weather. <sighs> the fat Asian, he is back. Alright guys, we're back with episode number two of the China Ruins Everything Career Mode. And as I asked you to give me some suggestions in the comment section on who to bring in and the best one that I actually heard for transfers since we only have about like 35 million in the budget is to go ahead and look for Zlatan's regen. And I was like, yes, yes. Uh, we are definitely going to go ahead and find Mr. Zlatan's regen. I believe, I mean, this is the only... Uh, Swedish striker that's in the Premier League. He plays for Watford. Johannes suggested We're just gonna call him Zlata. As you know with regents you cannot sign them right away But you can go ahead and uh, loan them for a season. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's do a short loan That's fine And then you know just get a little peek of his stats and then if he's good in January We'll go ahead and scoop him up But if I'm being honest Signing another striker is really not my priority because as you can see right now, uh, we have the likes of Rashford, Lukaku, Mbappe, Lawton, Ho Hugh amongst other people. So one of you brilliant minds came up with this comment. This might sound dumb, but just play a five striker formation. Let me tell you something about this channel. We are nothing if not dumb. Let's do it. <laughs> this is going to work out well. This is gonna work out well. And uh, let's go ahead and unleash this new formation. Let's go ahead and check in the calendar. Who do we have next? Denover. Oh, Manchester United in the Community Shield. This is this is gonna turn out well. And I also asked you guys to vote in a couple of things. Uh, I asked you where you know we should be strengthening up, and most of you guys said defenders, <laughs> defenders, defenders. I do not blame you. We need to go ahead and get another maybe fullback. And I asked you, we have too many strikers, what should I do with our youngsters? And the majority of you guys are just like, just loan them out. <laughs> like, don't get rid of Mbappe, don't get rid of Rashford or Jesus. So yeah, I'll go ahead and try that. So let's go ahead and start it off with a bit of Chinese hot parts. All right, we have sold Alex to Wands Bay. We've gotten 4.6 in. And we're gonna have a transfer offer for Hungman Sun, aka Kimchi the God. As much as I do like him, we kind of have too many forwards, too many wingers. So maybe, maybe, eh. Nothing more than 46. Buffer loan accepted for young Johannes Torsenbachenberg. So we're gonna go ahead and accept it and see the stats on it. I did. Uh, Gander, and he is six foot tall, but let's go ahead and take a look see look see. Soldier Bird! Woo! 91 acceleration, 96 agility, 88 bounds, 87 sprint speed, 65 straight? You have got to be kidding me. Wow, okay, so that's where he's absolute garbage. He is 52 in finishing, but everything else is extraordinary. He's even decent in in penalties, short passing, shot power, uh, long shots, four star skill moves, six foot tall, three star. Oh, but the work rates kind of kill him though. Low, low work rates. But we'll leave it up in the eye things, but I think it's almost a guaranteed. We have to get this kid. All right, get in there, Sochberg. If anyone Swedish knows how to pronounce that last name, let me know in the comments section as well. But we're gonna try to train up. I know it's gonna make him a little bit more expensive in January, but when we actually bring him in, he'll be worth it. Transfer offer for Yao Fang. Yes, we're gonna go ahead and send him out. We just need the money and we need more space on the benches, man. If we're gonna bring in more Chinese players and stuff, we hit the player cap limit last year. And we do wanna bring in a couple more, you know, pre-existing contract offers. Eh, probably not, we will see. Mohago well, says he wants to get paid more. All right, let's go over to contracts. We haven't done this in a while. Oh no, 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 no. No. He's been thinking about his future in football club and decided he does not want to sign the contract. I'll be letting his contract expire. Hago! Oh, My shrimpy dumpling poo. After all China has done for you, you turn your back on your own countrymen. I mean, he's still got two years on the contract, so. We'll be fine. So he's the only track. We have a loan deal for Marcus Rashford. I'm gonna sit on this one for now because I just want to play him up against Manchester United and play him in the five striker formation. 
and see how that goes first. Let's go over to Gao Gao and see if $100,000 will change his mind. Transfer over for Omar Toprak from Barcelona. I know you got that money, man. I know you got that hot money. 37. We got enough. We got enough. He's 30 years old. I think it's the perfect time to go ahead and move on from him. We have Sula and John Anthony Brooks who have higher top end talent than he does. And we fuck you, Zoe, as well. So I think we'll be fine. Ah, oh, God. Not a good start to the day. But basically, Hagao has said he's not going to do anything from this point on. And he might engineer and move away. Which means we might have to be forced to sell the shrimpy poo in this window if the board makes me. Go ahead, go into the community the shield. Hagao will be on the bench for this one though. But this is the five striker formation that I'm going to regret in about five minutes. Marcus Rashford, Lacazette, Romelu Lukaku, leading the line, Gabriel Jesus, Hungman Sun out on the left side. We got Mal, uh, Sula, and fuck you, Zoe. And Arier is the back line. Casemiro is our lone. <sighs> <laughs> Oh god, this is gonna be so dumb! Uh, hog out in between the sticks. Let's go. Alright, Chocolate Thunder. Your prayers have been answered. We're gonna be playing a five striker formation as Historic Wembley. China is about to unleash and revolutionize the footballing world today. This will be an interesting looking Manchester side as we've kind of stripped away from them a lot of their talent. Remember, we sniped away Dav De Gea on a pre-contract. And then, uh, we also took the likes of Marcus Rashford and Lukaku. Well, Lukaku wasn't on that side in this beginning of the save, wasn't there? So, Zlatan just retired. Rooney is probably getting up there, if not retired already. It should be very intriguing to see what they look like now. Manchester United, go ahead and start the list. Romero in between there. They got Harry Kane, Anthony Martial up top. All right, all right. I don't know who this Bird or Walter guy is in the midfield, but uh, Jones and Smalling pretty much the pairing that they have now. No buying. Interesting. I'm about to revolutionize the game, boys. You run over and lay out. Oh! Shit! <laughs> Anthony Martial! Oh, yes! Bruh. Bruh. Hit it harder, why didn't you? Alright. Time to chase the game. Oh! No! Yaka! Oh, that's a good ball. This bird kid. I don't know who he is. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Oh, great double save from Hog Out. No! I thought I took it away from him. What actually happened there? What actually happened? I tackled it right into the path of Harry Kane. The great experiment might be over, guys. Okay, apparently, get taken down the box. No biggie, no biggie. Okay, um, I mean, it's not even that bad. Look at this, we're dominating possession. We got shots off, we just can't put any on target. I think we got this, guys. I know it looks bad right now, but I think, okay, they're bringing on Pop. Never mind. But I don't mind I'm alive. Oh! <laughs> what a goddamn take! Show them your strength, Lukaku. Oh, you are devilishly delicious. Oh, that was a healthy servant. That was a healthy servant of the Lukaku. A lot of cock, not as much coo. God damn. Oh no! What a save! Oh fuck. Fuck us! That's a great cross. It's 3 1. If I'm up front, probably not the best choice. In, in, but everything's easy to say in hindsight, okay? So you were right, Chocolate Thunder. It sounded dumb. It was dumb. <laughs> but we will not play five. Uh, strikes us up, but I mean, it's community shields. It's just glorified friendly. We're just warming up, guys. So, with that, I think I probably will push on maybe like the likes of Marcus Rashford, you know, put him on loan and just play with that. Honestly, you know who let us down the most was Lacazette. 
a little bit concerning about our back line, and especially, I think, our fullback position. I like Mao, but he was just getting beaten. He's just not quite fast enough to deal with those pacey wingers. And then once he gets beat to the byline, and like how many crosses into that back far post, those dangerous crosses that we allowed in this one. Should we vote up in the I think it's right here? Should we look to upgrade at the left back position or should we just keep Mao and develop him? All right, they have rebuted with an offer of 22 million, but uh, I'm gonna rebuke with 20, uh, let's see. Do I go one year loan for Rashford? Yeah, we could always bring him back. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, 30, I'll accept 30. That is a fair deal for Oman Top Rack. We're gonna send him off to Barcelona over there. I think I'm gonna skip ahead of this Watford game and play this Leicester match just because I think it's a bit more competitive. Anyway, I'm gonna go more traditional over here. We got Lukaku on this side, Lacazette on the other. We got Hung Min Sun at the cam position. Maybe I could switch it up. Hmm, who's got better? Actually, let's put Oscar at the cam. He's a traditional cam. We got Koke and Lu Bu, the warlord, Bakayoko in the back line. Just to give him a little bit of run. Arya's still in there. We got Mal Malford now. In fact, let's, do, let's sub him out. We'll put Matiello in there and then we'll put Fuck You Zo, um, Hagao, and Sula. Let's try out John Anthony Brooks. A little bit more athleticism along Fuck You Zo could do him some good. Mmm. Send you say bye versus Lester. At famous Great Wall Stadium. It's been a while. It's been a while since we've gone to our home grounds. It's a beautiful stadium built with Chinese immigrant hands. The best immigrant hands, if you ask me. This is our first real test, man. Can we go ahead, put up or shut up in the Premier League? We faced Premier League talent before, but not actually in it. We don't actually know if we were facing full-fledged teams and cup competitions and all that such. So, Leicester City, former champions two years ago. Let's do this. Tale of Redemption in this one. Let's get it going. Oh, Gray. Woo, what a save. Yo! Oh, okay. <laughs> this is the first good thing Lacazette did well. Uh, he stood in the way <laughs> and got slid tackled. <laughs> Just trying to block off Lukaku's shot. Okay, you know what? Let's give this to Lacazette. Let's get him on the scoreboard. Maybe this will get him going. Yeah, there we go. Lacazette! Oh, okay. Okay, I think that's how I got to use him, man. He has, he's got to get the ball at his feet, have him turn, because that agility and then the burst to go ahead and get past the defenders. I'm seeing it now. I'm seeing it now. So what could be interesting is I play him as a central guy. Because I've been playing him, yo, get in behind, get out wide. Maybe I have him come short. <laughs> I will say, Lukaku he feels a little bit clunky at times. But just when he's in that space, man, he's just a fucking tank. All right. We cooking. We cooking now. Oh. Another pen. And it is Lacazette. And that is a red. Okay, I'm seeing it now. Let's go ahead. Let's give it to Laka. And ooh, roll it home. Roll it home, son. We haven't done it in a while. So everyone, just go ahead. Bring it. And folks all right a drumming a 4 nil drumming of freaking Lester well I mean what can you say what can you say I think I figured it out man how to use Lacazette to his fullest four shots uh, three of them goals two of them were pens and Lukaku was absolute monster out there as well but I think Lukaku playing the big target man you know what he should be up front goes ahead, holds up that space, holds the center backs up, and then Lacazette kind of dropping back in the false nine, dropping into the hole, kind of creating a little, and playing the one twos off Lukaku and running into space, uh, helping in the build up play, I think is going to do some wonders for us this season. But that is going to be it, guys, for episode two 
of the channel ruins everything career mode. If you did enjoy it, go ahead, kick a little bit of your hard work and we'll smoosh into that like button right now. If you want to get caught up on the first episode, go ahead and click over here, Dingsy Poos, and you want to check out my new series, the Reinvented Ultimate Career Mode Challenge. Go ahead and click down here, Dingsy Poos. Anyway, my name is Vyvon Soul, and you guys have a wonderful day. I'm a serious self. Stay humble. Be weird. Every single day, Fat Asian Nation grows fatter.